Hear me, boy. I lean enough island, I lean enough island. Put it by now. I lean enough island, I lean enough island. Check this. I is with my main woman, Sue Ramsey. She be a member of the assembly of Sinn Féin. Now, Sinn Féin, what's the vibe? Uh, Sinn Féin is a 32 county party. Our main aim is uh, the reunification of Ireland. And what is the language that they speak here? They speak Gaelic here. Gaelic? Gaelic, yeah. What is that, like a Bati language or something? <laughs> Like what is the real name for it? What is, Irish. What is the, it's called Irish. Irish, yes. So then when they're cussing it, they say it's like a no, gay no. man. Gaelic means Irish in Irish. Aye. Gaelic because in Irish. English, gay means a man who would sleep with another man. No, it's, it's, and the it's, lick it's, is like, uh, <laughs> you know. Is maybe the cause of the problem that they say they're, and maybe it's a stereotype or whatever, but they say the Irish is always up for the crack or whatever. Is that a problem because the crack make you violent? Me know people from me estate, they go mental and whenever there's someone around, they want to fight them, whatever. No. It's a bad drug. No, crack, crack in Ireland means having a good time. Having Aye, a for real. <laughs> they ain't, ooh, fun. It's also bad stuff as well. There's a high, but after you finish it, there's no, a low. Crack, crack in Ireland is in drugs. Ali in Ireland, Ali in Northern Ireland, Ali in Ireland, Ali in Northern Ireland. Boo! Wicked. I is with none other than my main man, the Lord Mayor of Ireland, David Odorice, <laughs> and we is having a cup of tea. <laughs> Hello, Ali. You're uh, very welcome to Belfast. I don't know what's going on here. <laughs> Why is there all the fighting? There are people in Northern Ireland who wish to be uh, part of a United Ireland. Uh, for real. And then there are people living in Northern Ireland who wish to remain uh, part of the United Kingdom. And where does Wogan stand? <laughs> who, sorry? Wogan. Wogan. <laughs> Terry Wogan. Uh, Terry Wogan. <laughs> Terry Wogan. <laughs> what is he? I have no idea what his political stance is. But was he not in the IRA? <laughs> Terry Wogan. No. No, he wasn't. I is here now with my main man, Sammy Wilson, in B from the DUP that mean the, the Democrat Party or something. So is you Irish? No, I'm British. So is you here on holiday? No, Northern Ireland has always been part of Britain. So why is everyone cussing the RAC? <laughs> well, I think it's the, the RUC. The, the, the Royal Ulster. The RAC <laughs> people is everyone today is saying they are A C they've chucked stones at them well, and whatever. And it ain't their fault if they don't come, you know, in mm. time or whatever. <laughs> not everyone is doing that. I, mean, I think that's the first thing. The vast majority of people in Northern Ireland actually use the police um, uh, for their own protection. But why they is they be. using a breakdown service as police? <laughs> that to me sounds like the most stupid thing. <laughs> No wonder they is fighting here or whatever if they if they do it. You see, I think you've got a mistake. It's the R U C. Which is the biggest city in Ireland? Which is the biggest city in Ireland? Dublin, because it keeps on doubling and doubling in size. Which is what? Have you got any jokes? Well, there's there's a joke that, that's often told about. Um, Ian Paisley, Aye. and uh, that he is he, on crack. He, he, he was he was, uh, <laughs> he was sw swimming across the. Is he on crack? No, he's not. <laughs> um, but he he was he was uh, faced with a river infested with crocodiles. Aye. And before he got in, he got this T-shirt with "I love the Pope" written on the back of Aye. it, and he swam across, and he got right away to the other side. And they asked, "How did you get so far without the crocodiles getting?" And he says, "The crocodiles would never swallow that." Is the Pope a Catholic? Ali in Ireland, Ali in Northern Ireland, Ali in Ireland, Ali in Northern Ireland. Boo! Boyakasha, check this. I is with George Patton. He be the chief executive of the Grand Orange Lodge of Ireland. Wicked. So let's talk about this march. What is this march that everyone banging on about? Yeah, that's a good question. Because uh, we don't see the fuss sometimes. Do you have music at this march? Oh, yeah. 
Yeah, lots of music. Oh, real. The whole world. Do you have drums? We have drums, yep. And is you like knocking out a drum and bass thing, or is it more kind of speed garage that you was knocking out? <laughs> it's, both, it's, it's all there. Uh, different drummers have their own rhythms. It's, it's an individual thing. Do you not think, though, me just, me not giving advice, but me saying from my own experience, sometimes it's good to back up the drums with a bit of human beatbox? Yeah. Uh, do you not think that would be good? Yes, of course it would. But if someone was doing the, you know, <laughs> people could chill from both sides and get into that. I hope that the people could. Alien Island, Alien.